how are you? My name's Nisha. I'm going to be your aide today. We're going to get you out of bed, okay? Okay. All right, let me go ahead and grab what I need, and I'll be right back, all right? So, all you need for this is your gate belt, and place it right there. You're going to need your now to your shoes when you're ready. And the first thing you'll do is lock your beds. That's the first thing you'll do. So lock your bed so you don't forget. And then I am going to take her cover off and apply her shoes. Because guess what? I told you I don't like that enough. Shoes. Now you can do this one or two ways. I, you can do this by setting her up or you can sit the head of the bed up whichever one you feel makes it easy or you can roll her to the side on her side and then swing the legs off and sit her up you can do whatever you want so me my to set this bed up so i'm gonna raise the head of the bed because now all i have to do is turn her around right so i'm gonna sit the bed up 90. Okay. How's that feel for you, Mr. Smith? You okay? Mm -hmm. All right. So now I'm going to place my hand behind your back. Now I'm going to put this hand under your leg. And we're going to turn you to the edge of the bed, okay? Mm -hmm. You ready? And you can help if you can, all right? Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. All right. So are you feeling dizzy or lightheaded? You are? Do I need to lay you back down? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So then you take your gate belt. The guys, this fits just like a belt. Because I've noticed a lot of people do struggle with putting the gate belt on so it goes through the loop, pull, and then in and tie in. So that's how you would do that. So we're going to put it on her. And once I get her all situated, I'll situate my chair. So I'm going to bring this around. Can you lift your arms for me, please? Thank you. And again, like I said, through the, through the loop. And I'm going to pull, and I have my two fingers in there already checking to make sure I have two fingers, which tells me it's not too tight. Okay. How did that feel for you? Good. Okay. All right. So now I need to make sure that her feet, can I move you up just a tad bit? One, two, three. Perfect. And then I'm going to make sure her feet are flat on the floor because that's what my book says to make sure her feet are flat on the floor i want to get every point that i can when i'm taking this test so her feet are on the floor your feet flat on the floor yeah. all right so now that she's sitting up she's on the edge of the bed her feet are flat on the floor i'm now going to adjust my chair to um where i need it to be and remember she's weak so i want to get this chair as close to this bed as i can so that I don't have to worry about no falls or injuries. So into this chair, she's going to go. So now I'm going to stand in front of her, her knees, my knees touching her knees or in front of me. I'm going to have her put her hands on my shoulder. On a count of three, we're going to stand up. We're going to do a little dance and pivot into this chair, okay? And I might move this back just a tad bit so I don't bump nothing. So on a count of three, just a stand pivot, okay? Let me go ahead and put my foot there. Ready? One, two, three, up and turn and then have a seat. Okay? And then I'm going to remove the gate belt. And do not pull. Just take it off. So now she's up. You okay? Yeah. Feeling all right? All right, good. So then now I can unlock my wheelchair, I can have her face or I can turn her or do whatever I want to do. If she wants to watch TV or anything like that. So I'm just going to bring her backward. And, and then I can say, here's your call light. Now I'm going to place my gate belt back where I got it from. Sanitize my hands to dry. And my skill is done. Okay.